Hello out there YouTube. What's going on guys? It is D-Dunn here, the most chill COD player. Back with some more Black Ops 3. I'm not sure what gameplay will be in the background, um, but in case you missed my last video, I do have, uh, I believe the kids would call it a banger nowadays. Uh, <laughs> I'm so old, it's depressing. Ah, but anyway, um, it should be a really good gameplay in the background. Either 120 kills or a nuclear of some sort. But anyway, um, as we like to do over here on this channel, I am going to talk about someone who's stupid or does something stupid or just a topic that's on my mind. This one kind of a combination of the two. Um, I've seen it around on several articles on a lot of social media. Um, uh, basically, um, this girl, she is in high school in Montana. Um, she went to school without a, without a bra. Um, she's wearing like an old off the shoulder tee. So it's pretty loose. Um, and according to the article, uh, she was wearing nipple stickers to prevent them from showing through the material on her shirt. Um, so she got in trouble. Okay. Um, the teacher said that her dress made, um, them or other people, I don't know if other people complained, but it made someone feel uncomfortable. Um, and so she was sent to the principal's office and they were like, yo, bruh, um, no pun intended. You need to, you know, cover your shit up. And so she was really upset. She took to social media and she complained about it. And here's the, the kind of point I want to make. And here's kind of the root of this whole article and why it kind of triggered me a little bit. Um, so she says the fact, this is her quote verbatim. The fact that I was told, uh, that I was told it makes people uncomfortable offending me because it's my body. Uh, it's, it is my natural body and I'm not sure why that is uncomfortable to somebody. Okay, so I'm looking at a picture of this girl right now. I'll link the article down in the description for you guys if you want to check it out. Um, it's a picture, it's like a screenshot of her Facebook. Okay, looking at this girl, it doesn't look like she has, it looks like she has fairly large breasts. Um, like a, probably like a C cup. And I don't think that's like misogynistic. That's just an observation that a normal human being could make, male or female. Okay, so... I don't know. I actually had a girl that I went to high school with who didn't wear bras. She never got in trouble. That's just, you know, the life she wanted to live. No one complained. It's not a big deal. But she did not have a very large chest. And those things were like, if she was walking at any reasonably fast pace, I swear to God, like, they were just, they, it was so obvious she wasn't wearing a bra because they were not contained. They were flopping around everywhere. It was really obvious that she was not wearing a bra. And it is kind of it is kind of uncomfortable to see someone's body parts just flopping around everywhere, um, and I know to some extent there's there's an argument to be made that maybe you know we should be more mature, breast or breast. But here's the thing: there's a there's a thing there's a time in a situation where dress is is an appropriate concern, and a public school is one of those things. You are around. Um, you know, it's supposed to be, uh, it's supposed to be a place of education where your focus is on learning more, um, understanding like the world growing up and having, especially around a bunch of like corny teenage guys, you know, I'm not saying that she should make accommodations to her wardrobe in order to appease men. But what I am saying is that you should have some sort of understanding that, you know, putting yourself out there like that is not necessarily appropriate in all situations just because it's your body. You know, it would, you know, it'd be the same if she was showing a lot of cleavage or like, you know, came to school and was wearing like, just like, what if she came to school only wearing a bra? That would be deemed just as inappropriate, I think, as wearing no bra and like having your boobs flop around everywhere. Um, <clears throat> so anyway, and kind of off that, she says it's uncomfortable. It makes people uncomfortable offended me because it's my body. Okay, that is your body and that's cool, but what if some dude is wearing shorts and like, I don't know, he he gets a boner in the middle of class and is just walking around with a giant boner in his gym shorts? Wouldn't that probably make you uncomfortable or are you going to be like, you know what? You know what? That's his body. That's his natural body doing its natural thing. That's fine. He should be allowed, you know, he should totally like be allowed to walk around with a boner sticking out. It's cool. No worries. No, you would probably be like, holy shit, get your dick under control. You need to do the up tuck or you need to like go sit down for a minute, take a cold shower. I don't know. 
But what I'm saying is it works both ways for both genders. She got called out on it. It's not her body that's upsetting people. It's the fact that her dress is kind of inappropriate. It shows off things that shouldn't be a focus whenever you're in a school environment. And I think she should have covered up. And I think that's what she did. Um, after the fact, um, there was a Facebook group called No Bra No Problem, which involved a lot of uh, schoolgirls that you went. And also some of the guys um, from the school came to school wearing bras over their shirts to kind of protest, I guess, her, you know, uh, whatever punishment she got. But to me, I think that's too far. You know, if you want to go outside on your own time and do your own thing without a bra on, if you want to go out in public and not wear a bra, cool. But whenever you are under, like, someone else's supervision at, like, some sort of institution, like a school, um, where you have some sort of authority figure over yourself then you need to listen like you need to follow those rules and you need to dress appropriately for that situation that's all i'm saying um i think it was handled well you know i think that she's not really you know obviously she has her own point of view and like i said there's a point to be made that you know we should be mature enough to you know understand you know um that breasts are just a body part just like anything else and we shouldn't make it a big deal but like i said at the same time there's a time and a place where where dress like that is appropriate and at school and especially at a high school I don't think is the place so anyway I would love to get your guys' thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section do you guys side with me do you think you know that she's you know just blowing this out of proportion it, it it's not a matter of her natural body um, offending people it's the fact that what she was wearing um, you know really probably highlighted some you know sexual body parts that shouldn't be a focus when they're in school or on the flip side of that do you think that i'm being a misogynistic asshole in that um, she should be allowed to walk around wearing whatever she wants or whatever she doesn't want like i said for me to make the argument that it should be okay because it's her natural body um I think is a flawed argument because like i said there are things like of the male anatomy like i said if someone were walking around with an erection uh, and everyone could see it through like their gym shorts or whatever it would make people uncomfortable he would be asked to be covered up it's not double standard um at least in my opinion so like i said i would love to get your guys's opinion down below i hope you enjoyed the gameplay and the commentary if you did uh, a like rating is always appreciated if you hated it that's fine dislike it and leave me a comment why um, also if you're new to my channel and you really enjoy my content a subscription is always appreciated check out all links below in the description and if you made it this far to the video to the very very end as always, I just want to thank you for your time. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.